That's pretty decent. That's what we come here for. Way over. Happy day. Just under. Just to live another day. Got the wife's name on it. Christmas crab looking good. 2023. Hi and welcome to another episode of Vision Homes Jet Ski Adventures. Today we're going to take the jet ski out. We've got it set up for the crab pots. I know if you've seen these um, these pop-up pop crab pots, crab and gear pots. They're great for the jet skis. They're really easy to pop up. I'll show you that a bit later on. Um, so yeah, that's actually eight crab pots on the back. So there's Shah and I going out. My wife's coming out again. Happy days. So four pots each is the legal amount in Queensland, Australia. Um, there's been a bit of rain, we might get a few sandies, they're probably on the move. We're just going to throw them in for three, four hours, see how we go. I'm going to try and put this Insta360 camera in one of the pots with a couple of zip ties and hopefully we get a bit of footage. And uh, yeah, so we'll head out and see how we go. Okay, so these crab pots for jet skis are pretty good. Let's have a look at this. All you gotta do is pop them up, like that, and they're ready to go. So, pretty straightforward. I pre baited them before we came out on the jet ski. They obviously got limited room on the jet ski, so pre baited them, ready to go. Here we go. Shah's gonna put us in the right spot, not too close to the other pot. Make sure the rope stays away from the jet ski, so it doesn't get sucked up and under. Okay, that's pot number one. So we'll go up a little bit up here, put another one in, same procedure. Yeah, this looks like a good enough spot. So here's Shah's pot, the second pot. So let's go, we'll put this one in. Okay, so I'll make sure that's all good to go. We've got Charmaine on this one. So look, we might be a lucky pot. It's got the wife's name on it. Happy days. Throw that one out. Pot number two, six to go. Okay, actually I'll just drop one here, why not? Uh, pot number three, if you just reverse. Yeah, the okay, you see in here we've got the Insta360 inside the crab pot. If you can see that, and we'll see if we can get a bit of footage of the crabs climbing into the pot. We're just going to go out a little bit away from these white ones. We're probably going to go another 10, 15 metres out further and we'll throw this in and see if we can get some actual good footage. Beautiful, that's going in. Buy Insta360. <laughs> right. Let's see how we go. That's a nice, the cool cabana setup. Have a bit of lunch while we're just waiting for the crab pots. See if we can't catch a few sandies. And yeah, happy days. Picnic time with the wife. And here comes that rain. Forecast was correct. Freezing cold, babe. Really cold. Yeah. Let's get some water, some cheese. And uh, the old chicharons. Find us all that. <laughs> oh yeah, we us give a plug to uh, Bracken Ridge Kebab Shop for Chitra. There we go. Happy days. Perfect. Okay, so the pots have been soaking for about three hours, three and a half hours, so not a long time. Had a few jennies. We've just got our first legal in here. Looks like a decent size one. Let's have a look at him. 
That's pretty decent, that's what we come here for. Check him out. Way over. So happy days. We'll throw him in on the ice. Here we go. Bang. Dinner. Okay, so first pot of the day, and uh, we got a legal, that's an overnight soak. So I only soaked it for three and a half hours yesterday and got one. First pot, one keeper. Christmas crabs looking good, 2023. Okay, second pot. Let's have a look, it feels like it's got a bit of weight. Ah, and oh, we've got a couple of Jennies, that might be a keeper there. Oh, the top's come undone. Oh, how did that happen? Well, it could have been slightly rated. Okay, so we'll see if this guy looks like he might just go legal. So we'll have a look. Yep, he's legal as well. So a little trick here is people think you, that you measure from spine from these little spiny bits, spiny bit, but that's incorrect. You actually have to measure the shell across, and that guy's good. So okay, two from two. Slow and steady wins the race. A couple of Jennies, we'll throw them back. Got a good hold on this, this guy. There you go, got it. In there, two from two. Christmas is getting merrier. There we go, a couple of girls going back in. That was a big girl. Yay! It's a bit better, so we'll leave it in this spot. So maybe we'll put them further down this way. Okay, let's have a look. What are we going to do? There's a keeper. I can see straight away. Keeper. That's a good size one. Hey. Mine's going in. That's the only keeper probably, but it's still. Look at that. Decent. Yeah. Not bad. Hey. Let's see if any of these ones make what size. Hey, this one. That's a penny, is it? What about this one? Okay, he's under. Okay, put him back. He's going back in. This one looks. No, I'll come back to you, buddy. Got his friend. Huh. Oh. Hi, right, that's male too. Yeah, they're all male because they're, they're blue. So, now here's one like if you if someone caught this and went edge to edge, very very close. But unfortunately, it's just slightly under and it's chocker too. But it, here's what I was saying. So, so from spine to spine. You'd think it's legal, however, it's actually from carcass to carcass, and that is millimetres under if you zoom in on that. That one's just under. Gets to live another day. Oh yeah, that is a bigger one. No, this one is. That's a bigger one than the other one. And he is on. Yeah. Hey, okay. that one's just legal, so had one just under. One just legal, we're definitely putting back in this spot and we might pepper this spot. Picked up a couple of crabs, it's got a few in here, and starting to get together a feed, so we'll have a look at this. There we go, there's a few, we'll go back out this afternoon and check the pots. There's a few to go with that big one we got yesterday and then hopefully we'll get a few more this afternoon. Okay, so another nice sandy, if you have a look at that, you can see it's a male underneath, so that's decent, not a bad one for a sandy, 
He's definitely legal. We've got another one, we'll mess that one up. Might be just under. But um, yeah, so that's good. That's crab number six for Christmas. <laughs> oh. Now we'll check this little sucker. All right, we'll measure this one up. He looks under. Grabbing on the ebony. He looks tasty. Let's have a look. Maybe that was such a big one, it's deceiving. Oh, he might be on. Yeah, two legals. Hey, I had that other one's that big. But this made this one look undersized, but he's, he's good. <laughs> so happy days, that's two. Crab number seven. Crab number nine. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know what? He's under. So that's negative one. See how. Okay, crab number eight. We're reversed it. Crab number eight. Okay, last pot for the Christmas crabs. We thought we had nine. He was just under size. We got eight. Let's see what's in the last pot. We got enough for a nice Christmas feed. It's got a bit of weight in it. One uh, female. We've got one in there. Oh, no, it's good. He's, he's a male, but he usually makes size. He's a feisty one. Hello, buddy. I'm your friend. I'm going to eat you. I'll give you a hot bath later on. Alright, let's have a look. Let's see if he makes cut or if he gets to swim another day. So he's under, so eight of his, lucky eight, Chinese lucky eight, and this one gets to live another day. See you later little buddy, I'm not going to kiss you, but happy days. still holding the jet ski in place so if you're launching by yourself or retrieving it by yourself it's a great little trick once you're comfortable with the ski that's now on safety clips on it's all secure I can turn off the engine once you're comfortable with your ski, that's the easy way to launch it and retrieve it yourself and ride straight back on. How good was that? We went out in the jet ski, Shah was driving, I was throwing the pots in. Um, you can take eight crab pots out on the back of that of the jet ski comfortably. We had no issues throwing them out, out, pulling them in. Picked up a couple crabs, picked up some solid ones, some nice ones there. A couple more Christmas crabs. So, happy days. Had one last night. It's pretty easy to, to pull the crabs out while you're on the jet ski and you know we'd, we'd use a hook to pull in the rope. Uh, this made it really easy too because when you've got those tubbies the crabs can get right up underneath. So Anthony from JetLeds made this for me. Stainless steel slots into the tubbies and if you're getting you know red claw, sand crabs, mud crabs, doesn't matter. Happy days. I'll put a link in, in the episode in the, in the description so if you do like crabbing off a jet ski if I'm um, hit Anthony up for one of these made it a bit easier than reaching right down the back of the tubbies nearly getting bitten by mud crabs and stuff like that so this will be Christmas feast couple days time I'll show you that a bit later on and happy days crabbing from a jet ski Merry Christmas <laughs> Oh, 
Please. Please.